Welcome back to Sports Extra presented by Toyota. This afternoon in San Diego, the Mets and Padres had their rubber game before the Mets return home this week. Before the game, there's some news for you here. Manager Mickey Calloway said Jay Bruce will start playing some games at first base so they can get Brandon Nimmo back in the lineup. And today, the lineup got going with some early runs, but watch out here. Yoenna Cespedes looks like he jams his left thumb as he goes sliding headfirst into third base on a steal. Now Cespedes then leaves the game the following inning, but after seeing him smiling in the dugout afterwards, it appears Cespedes was pulled from the game for just precaution, and the team is calling it a sore left thumb. The Mets made up for his missing bat. Adrian Gonzalez, maybe he's taken the Bruce to first base news to heart, hitting a three-run home run to go with five RBIs on the day, putting the Mets up 7-2 in the seventh inning, and there's Jose Reyes getting in on the act as well, hitting his first home run of the year, the Mets end the road trip in style, beating the Padres with a final score, 14 to 2. 0-1 delivery to him and a towering shot way back in right field. Everybody's just watching. Oh, that hit three quarters of the way up on that scoreboard. Mo Vaughn with a mountain of a shot. And how about this for one of our baseball in-studio guests, a three-time Major League Baseball All-Star, 1995 AL MVP. Yes, he is a former member of your New York Mets and the Boston Red Sox as well. <laughs> Mo Vaughn joining me here in studio. Mo, how are you? I'm good. Thanks for having me this morning. Oh, it's great to see you here good. in New York. Thanks. Mo, you've got a lot going on. I mean, has it really been 15 years, though, since you retired? It, it has, and oh. it's, it's, it's gone fast. Uh, I've been lucky enough to do some things after life uh, that have been successful. I've developed in this line of MVP collections. I got into the real estate business. And yeah. Still, do, still doing very well at that. So it's, uh, you know, I'm 50 years old. Oh. So, you know. Um, we look great. Yeah, thanks. You know, uh, <laughs> I'm here and I'm just trying to go out and, and, and produce good product. All right, we're going to talk about your MVP collection. You're going to take us through it in a little bit. But yes. how much baseball are you watching these days? I watch it all. You know, you I'm, a, I'm, a, I'm a fan. Uh, I'm an MLB fan. I'm a fan of the players. Um, I'm a Sox fan. You know, you know, you know, you know that. <laughs> Indigenous to those Red Sox it's, nation. It's, There's a lot of Red Sox fans around here. Sox nation is, is huge. <laughs> um, I see the Mets are playing well. You yeah, know, you what do you think? Great. Listen, you know, you get off to a to a great start like that. You know, new manager, yeah. things are happening, guys come together. That's how things form. Right. You know what I mean? That's how things get going. So um, I'm, I'm glad to see the Mets playing well also. You hit one of the most memorable home runs back in 2002. Mm -hmm. What do you remember about that home run where it hit Just, the FUD sign? <laughs> I always don't remember that as much as how loud it was, yeah. so the sound. And that's like perfect contact, perfect angle, perfect velocity. It takes a lot, you know, he supplies a lot of the power to the pitcher. So, mm. you know, just one of those things that went well. That the, one, the one good thing I did, did okay when I played in New York. <laughs> but now this MVP clothing collection, how did you get into clothing a couple of years ago? Listen, I've been looking for this for a long time. So um, you've always liked fashion um, clothing? I, it's just I was always looking for fashion style for the big guy. Okay. And it, and it, and it wasn't there. Did you have to get um, custom suits made? And I got everything mm -hmm. made. And... I just, you know, and it was lucky for me. I know I had some dispensable income right. to do that. So I wanted to bring a, a style for the big and tall guy. And my biggest mantra is, is why can't the big and tall guy look like everybody else? What makes yours stand out? Oh, we're fashion. Yeah, I could we're see it right away. Fashion. We, are, we are cutting edge trend. We're made in America, number one. Um, that helps us on just the fact that we can reproduce the line in an eight or, ten, eight or ten week period where we're going wow. overseas, it takes, we process, we source all our stuff out of LA. But the difference is we are fashion, which, you know, when we started this thing on, you know, e -com and, you know, you're getting, you know, the results of what people want, you're listening right. to, to the customer, and we do a lot of listening to our customers. You know, I came out in basics. Nobody bought a thing. Oh. And then we started, you know, you know, Diane started talking about pushing the fashion side, the and style. And Diane's the, your partner. The, yes. Diane's my partner. Pushing the, the, the and, style and the and colors. The studs, and the, the materials. I mean, this is it right here. Look yeah. at the, the animal example. print. Love the animal print. Um, we got, one of, on black. Shirt. We got mm -hmm. one of our shirts. This is the, the leather bomber. Right. Um, and you have different color. That's a different color in the leather bomber, the white. 
you know, the, the leather bottom and the white is kind of like the same thing great. of what I got on right here. And Mo, people can get, this is online, this is e-commerce. You, can get, can, get on, you can get it at mvpcollections.com. Okay. We're also in, in, in 50 DXL stores. Oh, you are? So, you know, you can go and see that. And the main thing with, you know, also being made in America is I didn't want to bring any type, you know, regular brand. Mm -hmm. This is, you touch our stuff. Our stuff is feels good. The fabrics, um, it feels good. It, it, it stretches. I knew nothing about stretch. Well, that's a good point. You until need I that. Got Big in, and tall. Until I got into the game, <laughs> I knew nothing about stretch. And it's it's just a great. I wanted to bring an elevated product, and we're doing that. What about the jeans in the back there? I see some of the moto, the different, the well, distressed jeans. This is the moto jean. Yeah, show them and today. We started this. We started this. Let me feel that. See, that's the feel thing. And what'd you feels. learn about the different materials? That's what's Listen, so neat. I, I, this is I had soft. to be I had to be coached. That's the thing. But it looks so expensive. What's the price point? But, uh, price point, you know, 129 bucks on a jean. You that's know what I mean? Really good price. So, that's awesome. and the moto jean, again, like this was our first product and this thing is continuing to sell. So, so this, we're making I this. A lot of big we're making tall this. Guys, the different exactly. patterns. Exactly. We're so making that's this different. In many, many different colors. I mean, this is the first thing we came out with, and it's still rocking right now. So you kind of so, come out with it so in your next keep collection. Keep, keep, keep coming with it. We that's got great. camouflage here. You know that we're Can't doing. Can't go wrong with camouflage. Can't go wrong with the camouflage. Oh yeah. So and feel that shirt. And again, two different materials. Right. Feel it. That's a two XL size. Exactly. I got to do some Christmas shopping so, right now for my husband. And this is a new the thing that this is a yeah. new thing, Jean, that we're coming out with. It's it's the uh, it's painting. Love it. Feel the feel the material. Feel the stretch. It's it's, it's stretchy but rich. Look at right. <laughs> this exactly. is great. Exactly. These are fantastic. So, so, so on your website, everything's available. On you the got website, the high end, the casual, the trendy, which yeah. wasn't there for the big and tall guy. That's the thing. There was no fashion. I mean, Diane was yelling about, you know, you know, we always wore black, gray, and blue. And the big and tall suits. Because, and, and that's yeah, all we just wore. Like a suit if you and want we were afraid to put on the colors, because, you know, the colors weren't looking right in the materials. Right. Now, you, we got this yellow jean coming out that is going to be ripped, sexy, that's going to be hot, and I'm into the colors now, Love so it. it's, it's, it's really working out for us. Well, congratulations on Thanks. everything you've done post-career, but it was also a pretty darn good MLB career. I appreciate then it. In the, in the uh, baseball, the uh, Red Sox Hall of Fame as well, but we remember you here in New York with that, those big home runs for the Mets. Thank you. Move on. Great to see you. Thanks a lot.